Hello and welcome. I'm Sadna from Sadna Photography. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today's video is about the peeking toe wrap. I do this wrap for all my mini sessions for like 30 minutes or 45 minutes session. So this is a quick wrap and easy wrap to do. And also parents love to see those peeking toes, the tiny little fingers, uh, the toe fingers. And uh, they ask me like, we want the toes to be shown or the hands to be shown. So this is one of my quickest and easiest wrap. I sometimes call this a peeking toe wrap or praying wrap, praying toe wrap, or um, I call it a butterfly, butterfly wrap or zigzag or eight. I, I name it as I want, but right now I'm naming it as a peeking toe wrap. So let's get started. So uh, for this, you're going to place the baby in the middle and always secure the hands and it's like uh, the praying toes uh, it's just not like the toes are peeking it's the praying uh, pose so you keep the legs like this but I'm using a, a model so um, the doll doesn't give the exact shape as a baby but I'm just showing it this is for the teaching purpose. So take two ends of um, the wrap and tie the toes. I always go um, twice because babies wiggle, so I always make it like a two knot and then take it from the right always make sure uh, once you do the knot just use your tummy or your chest and push the legs up with your chest push your legs up I mean push the baby's legs up and then secure the hands, right to left and left to right. Use a stretchy wrap and a thin wrap for this one so that it doesn't look bulkier. And then do a twist. Hold it tight guys, hold this tight. Do a twist and then Take it from the left. I sometimes also call this a butterfly wrap. And then hold the right side tight and bring this to the right. Make sure you always support your legs like this. I mean the baby's legs. And then pull it and then bring it down like a shape eight like bring it down bring it across the legs and then bring it back with the baby and there you go Use a very stretchy wrap for this. So this is from the Mimosa House Worm. He has a big collection. And then the remaining part, you can just tuck it in. It's the same way. Take it from the right and bring it back. down and take it up like an eight and 
and then put it back and then you can just tuck it in or you can just place it beneath the baby's back so that you know it just stays where it is where oops sorry You can tuck it in like that or you can just leave it so make sure the um okay this is um the baby um mannequin like it's a model doll so the the legs doesn't stay like the baby's legs it's slipping over but you will get a lovely peeking toe when you do it There you go. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do a, a quick setup. This is how I do it for my quick sessions, like my mini sessions. So let me do the setup for you. So what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to set it up in my balcony today because there's no light, uh, available light inside my house and I don't have time to set up the lights and stuff so I'm just doing it in my balcony. So uh, this is how I set it up. This is the dusk background from Intuition Backgrounds and this is a basket from Etsy. It's an Etsy find. I can um, post the link in the description box. So this is how I set it up and I keep a iron plate on top of this like a weight but I don't have it right now so what I do is I place these pulsing pillows and I take this basket stuffer the baby's tushy is up so that you get a little bit of a bump right there. There you go. So um, since I'm using a doll, I will not be able to do it. But if you are having a real baby, all you have to do is just tilt the head like that. And you can tilt the body towards your right and make it like a curve. Mm. I can post a picture that I took in the same pose um, so that you can um, get it like what I'm talking about but this is the setup for right now so hope you guys like it and this is for a mini session I love 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 the intuition backdrops as you guys can see it it's almost sunset and it's getting darker so um, I was able to take only a few pictures with the natural light available um, hope you guys like it and this is the way I do the setup and I love the intuition backgrounds and I have a quick review on the Tugo pack that I um, purchased from intuition backgrounds and that is what I just used it as well have a great day bye